I'm out of breath from the previous one. Um, put it on my hip. It's fine. Okay, next one. Your exercise is going to be push up. Um, the push up. Ooh, the fabulous chest exercise. Chest and, it's going to work your chest and triceps particularly. If you're strong, uh, which most adults aren't, uh, particularly. Um, stop saying arm. Uh, <laughs> uh, if you're strong, do a full manly push up, which is uh, on the ground, chest right in between your arms. Uh, don't want any of these, it's terrible, and you see a lot of them, in, especially in exercise classes. Uh, hand, hand, chest, and then you're going to go go as wide as you feel it is most comfortable for you right now with your hand position, and then you're just going to bring your chest to the ground and push up from there. Go as low as you feel you can, but I would say that if you can't do a full push up, if you can only sort of go to there, <laughs> then uh, bring your knees to the ground and drop your Engage your glutes so your back stays nice and strong. So you want this part not to dip down during the exercise. And when you go down, you just go down in between your hands with your chest and push up from there. The more, the narrower you come with your hands, the more it's going to work your triceps. And the wider you go, the more it's going to work the bigger muscles on your chest. So unless you've got a specific reason to do more um, tricep work, I would recommend that you probably um, focus on working the regular range, the normal sort of most comfortable range, or even slightly wider. Uh, you can also, you know, switch them up. It's always a good idea not to just not, not just to do one version of an exercise to keep the body guessing what's coming. Okay, if those knees on the floor push-ups are too hard, still, then get into a box position. This is, this is a bit weird, especially for anyone with slightly dodgy shoulders, this is not the best version of the exercise, but box position, i.e. on all fours, and then you're just gonna go down from there. You can also do variations where you just get up on a higher uh, surface. So you use like a table or just bench or, chairs or, or uh, anything um, where you bring your hands up higher and then you go down from there makes the proper push up a little bit easier and it'll be better for your um developing your strength during that um sometimes i even have people do push-ups up against that i've got a doorway there i'll show you the toilet roll on the floor <laughs> Okay, uh, here we go. Oh, water. You can see that enough. So I do hands here, chest down. So you can get a really, really, really good stretch. So you can sort of go lower down than you would if you're on the ground. And then just do push ups from there. And actually, like, that's really, really nice because if you really work on the depth, it's a fantastic. Like, I find it. Really nice, really slightly challenging as well. If you're a machine um, and are well acquainted with your push ups, where are we? Hi. Uh, then you can go crazy and start lifting your feet up to go into an incline position. <laughs> and do your push ups like that. If you're ridiculous, just do handstand push ups. I get into handstand position and do them from there. Anything else? Push-ups, push-ups, yeah. Great chest and tricep um, thing, yeah, thing. Yeah, that's it, enjoy.